Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to my channel, my dear friends. My name is Avilash and I'm your trader next door. In this video, I'll be analyzing the chart of Euro GBP for Monday. So if you're watching my videos for the first time, then please subscribe to my channel for regular market analysis. And do not forget to check out the Forex analysis playlist on my YouTube channel for the analysis of other pairs like Euro USD, GBP USD, Gold USD, and many more. So let's get started. So this is the photo chart of Euro GBP in front of us right now. And as you can see, my dear friends, that I have got many lines here, many levels here drawn on the chart. So do not get confused. I'll be explaining them one by one so that you can have the proper picture of the Euro GBP chart. So let's try to understand what is going on in the chart of Euro GBP. Then we'll be jumping to the strategy part. Clear? Let's get started. So if you look at the overall chart of Euro GBP here, then we can see that overall trend on the market is towards the downside yes this market is in downtrend and apart from this downtrend we can see that whenever market is going down it is also taking support at this trend line you can see that on numerous occasions this trend line is acting as a very strong support for the market whenever market came down this level was always present for the euro gbp chart to provide support to the market therefore my dear friends if you do not have this line drawn on your charting platform then i request you to draw this line because it may not be on monday or tuesday or next week in the future also whenever market will be coming down then you can expect that you get a good trade at this particular trend line so whenever market will be bouncing from here easily you can click on the buy button so it may not be today or tomorrow day after tomorrow but in the future you are getting a good trade at this trend line so this trend line is trend line part is clear and if we look at this particular portion of the chart here okay so overall trend is towards the downside there is no doubt about it but if we look at this particular portion of the chart here then we can see that overall trend may, may be towards the downside but right now this market is an uptrend and you can see that this market is extremely bullish right now and there should not be doubt about it so overall trend is towards the downside but the present trend is indicating that market is extremely bullish so both the things are very much contradictory they are going against each other <laughs> So we do not have any proper uh, or unilateral trade here. You need a directional trade here. Overall trend is going towards the downside, but the present trend is going indicating that market is going towards the upside. And to clear out the doubt here, what we can do is that we can just switch over to the weekly time frame once, because weekly time frame is a time frame of the big boys, the institutional traders, and therefore weekly time frame has got an importance on its own. So if we remove the drawings here, then you can see that when market was coming down or market was facing uh, selling pressure from above, this level provided support to the market, market went up. Again, when market faced selling pressure, this was the level that provided support to the market. So 0 0.8450, let me draw a line here. This line or this level is extremely important for the market because this level is a sort of strong support for the market from the weekly chart. But apart from this support level, what we can notice is that market has also formed a green candle here, which means that market has successfully taken support and market has got the required amount of support and market is about to go up from here. So market is bullish. Therefore, present trend is towards the upside therefore we will also be looking towards the uh, we will also be looking for buying opportunities only because we cannot go against the trend of the market and right now you can see that market has taken support and bounce and not from any other support level market has bounced from the support level from the weekly chart and therefore we will only go with the present trend only clear because we should not be trading against the weekly chart because the weekly chart is extremely important and crucial for any market okay any market so 
market present market is an uptrend till now we have the direction here so you can see that whenever market was going up from here it was also following a trend line and this trend line is also kind of acting as a support for the market here so this trend line is also important for you and you must also draw this trend line on your charting platform as well so you have the understanding about this trend line and now you have also understood the importance of this trend line as well therefore now comes the main part that is the area of value in my hundreds of videos i have discussed about area of value area of value means the best trading opportunity or the best trading spot in a downtrend market the best selling opportunity is always near the resistance whereas in an uptrend market if a market is going up then best buying opportunity is always near the support and we have a support in front of us right now so the first trading opportunity on the euro gbp chart is this trend line yes this trend line is your first trading opportunity therefore you must draw this line as well because from the weekly chart we have the confirmation that yes we have we can go for buying orders right now therefore in case you find market coming down in case you find market coming down and taking support at this trend line you can easily go for a buy when market will be bouncing from this trend line you can go for a buy and that is your first and the safest trading opportunity on the euro gbp chart right now clear your second trading opportunity is as you can see that market is extremely bullish right now so market may not okay listen to me carefully market may not come down to the trend line to take support and market on the other hand if you may see okay on the other hand you may see market just bouncing from this level 0 0.84 sorry 0. Um, 0 0.850 in this particular portion of the chart Okay, you can see market bouncing okay market sometimes market doesn't come down to the trend line so in that case if market bounces from this level also 0 0.8550 you can also go for a buy just keep in mind that confirmation is important and you'll get a confirmation in the form of a hammer pattern or a big green candle like this once you see the market is bouncing from this particular level or this trend line you can go for a buy so these are the trading opportunities for you right now and another <coughs> another trading level is here this is the resistance for the market and we won't be discussing about this level because right now the current market price is far away because this level mean is not required for monday right now and i do not buy or sell at this particular portion of the market here because see if you go for a buy here then your stop loss will be here your risk to reward ratio does not match and in a market condition like this there is no logic to short the market here if you short the market here you will be going against the trend that is also a very bad thing wrong thing so you do not have any other option wait for the market to come down to this particular level or this trend line then only go for buy order so these are the opportunities for you right now and if we go to the forex sentiment meter here you can see that 60% retail traders have taken short position and 39% retail traders have taken long position. So as we all know, 90% retail traders lose money. So do not follow their sentiment. Trade wisely. Trade with your proper analysis. And you'll find a forex sentiment meter on my website avilashazadika.com under forex 101 section. And recently, my dear friends, I have also launched a pro trader membership program where you can be a part of my analysis for just $15 per month where I'll be sharing all the best opportunities available on the market if you want to know more just just go through the information and if you're interested just click on the subscribe button that's it thank you so much all the best take care see you on Monday again bye bye